Hey guys, it's Hef. I am back again and today I am going to do an unboxing of some mystery type things. So I have a uh, Kinder Surprise here, which I know you can't get in America because these are banned. Um, surprising enough. I have this one, which is like Kinder Surprise, but it's a Star Wars egg. I have one of these little Shopkins Happy Places uh, ones. I haven't seen those ones before. And I have two of these Shopkins. These are Season 7 ones. Come with a cute little boxy thing inside. So I thought for something completely different, I would do a mystery unboxing of these. So I'll start with this one, which is already partly opened. Um, I haven't. These have been sitting in my collection for a while because I meant to do a video. Um, they come with a little card thing to tell you which one you've got and whether it is rare or super rare. Plastic thing. Two cute little boxes. Pink one and a purple one. So in the pink one we have blind bags. Yay. And the first one we have looks like a juice box, um, like a, what do we call them in Australia? Wow, I had a complete brain fart. Fruit boxes. It's, it's night time. <laughs> I'll blame that. So on our little thing, um, let's see if we can find it. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Lucy juice box. Um, I'm assuming white is like common. It's been so long since I've opened one of these. Yeah, it's common. Okay, so that was the first one is Lucy juice box. Stick her in there. And in the purple one. what looks like a cake with candles on it. So let's see if we can find this. It's not. It looks like that one there. So it is Blaze. Little Blaze. So from the look of that, there's like three different cakes and you can actually stack them together to make a big cake. So I actually have the one that goes on top. Little Blaze. And they are rare. So there's Little Blaze. Obviously it's called Blaze because he's got candles. That makes a whole lot of sense. Oops. And then we have another one of those. So we'll open that one. Um, I'm going to use my knife. Just to break the plastic. Oops, just because it makes it so much easier for me. Oops. Well, apparently the pink one wants to be open first. Oh, that tore really easy. <gasps> it looks like a butterfly -y sort of thing. That's really cool. Let's see if I can find it on the picture. Oops. Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's actually just supposed to be wings. It is Winola wings. And it's a common one. It's very cute though. I like that. Because it kind of looks like a butterfly, even if it's just the wings. Um, 
from the fancy dress body. And, oops, sorry, bump the camera. It's much harder to work around a camera than it is um, in front of a camera. And in the purple one, Oh, we have one that's all sparkly and glittery. Can you see the sparkle and glitter? You probably can't with this weird light. But it's it's covered in glitter. And I believe it is this one right here. Little wedding dress. And that one is ultra rare. How cool is that? It's all sparkly. That is so cute, and like even the, the, the top part of the the dress, it's so detailed, it's got even little tiny bottoms right there. That is so cool. And a little bouquet in her hand. Oh, that is awesome. So that is a little wedding dress. So those are the ordinary shop curtains ones. Let's stick them over there. And then we have this other Shopkins one, which apparently has three petkins and one tile inside. So, again, use a knife to get plastic off because, you know. That never works for me. And inside, we have this, which is, I guess that's the tile thing. And it looks like it connects to other ones, so you can have like a whole display thing going on. So that's pretty cool. And Three blind bags all joined together. And then we have the catalogue party thing. And this kind of shows you, you can click them together and extend them. All sorts of stuff going on in here. Wow. That's a super comprehensive catalog thing. And there's two sides to it. <laughs> there's so much going on. Okay. So, let's see what These are really simple packets. So I'm sorry if you don't like them. Look how small, look, see how big the packet is. You can see how small the ones are inside. I don't have anything big in here, I can tell you that right now. So, in the first one, we have hollow, oh, even opens. Um, it looks like a little book type thing. Hang on, let's see if I can find it. Find it. Okay, so it kind of looks, oops, it kind of looks a little bit like this one here, which is the DVD, but it's not the same. It's like a slightly different, so I think that's probably, uh, or it's this one here, which again is slightly different, but it's closer to that one, which is um, a magazine. So that's what it looks like. It's just a different colour to the, the, the picture. But it's got the little swipey thing down it, so I think that's what it's supposed to be. Is a magazine. So that's, that's kind of cute. That is knocked over my thing. Oops. Alright. So, we the one on the other end. Ah, oh, 
that's so cute. There's a little cactus in a pot. Um, which is this one right here. Um, number 19, which is... Okay. 19 does... It says cushion. It's not 19, it's 6. I can't read. Cactus plant pot. Um... Oh, apparently they come in different colours. Well, there you go. Interesting. Um, yeah, so little cactus. I, I don't know whether they're... The, um, whether that means something. The colours next to it. Anyway. It's a little cactus pot. Cactuses are a funny thing. Apparently cactuses are really, really hard to kill. But once upon a time, my mum bought me a little cactus in a pot because I have a black thumb. And we, it was called The Rock. And you weren't supposed to be able to kill it. And I did. I killed it with kindness. I watered it too much and it died. It rotted from the inside out. Um, and this thing was supposed to not be able to be killed. I proved them wrong. Um, but yeah. <laughs> You didn't need to know that story, but I told you anyway. And the last one. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to cheat. Yeah, no, that wasn't very sad. Whoops. Oh, it looks like the magazine right thing. Am I right? Am I right? Yep, look. Looks like the little magazine wrap. Or, oh no, it's probably this one over here. Um, it's the wood holder for putting the woods in next to the fireplace. Hey, how cute is that? So in my little kitchen, I'm actually going to put my um, magazine in the wood holder because why not? Okay, okay little house set. How cute. Um, put that over there with the uh, shotguns that want to fall down all the time. Mainly because I keep on knocking the box over. Okay. So, let's move on to the two chocolate ones. Uh, this Kinder Surprise, I think, is... Um, the Barbie type one because it's got pink on the top but I'm not sure but I'm going to start with the Star Wars one um, so of course there is chocolate inside this one is not a Kinder Chocolate but I'm expecting it to be the same as Kinder Chocolate so white on the inside normally I was wrong it's just brown and chocolate just went everywhere not that that's a bad thing because chocolate is great um, but very hard chocolate. Kinder Surprises are a softer chocolate, they're much easier to break than that. So this is a little container -y thing that's inside them. It's pop top. Oh, see who I've got? R2D2. I used to keep these containers to put little things in like earring backings. There you go. How cool is that? Little R2D2. chocolate everywhere so there's with these ones you just like you don't get very much information they, they don't tell you anything they don't fun so that is that one I'll just clean up some of this chocolate and we'll go into the Kinder Surprise I think it's so silly that you can't get these in America how yeah, easy these are to open And the chocolate pops open so easily. You can see how it's white on the inside. It's really nice chocolate too. I quite like it. I, but then I quite like most chocolate. So, okay, so this is a little container. 
I don't know whether I'm going to have one I have to put together. Oh, yes, I did. I got one I need to put together. It's not a complicated one, though, because it's a flower. I got a flower. Um, these ones generally come with instructions on how to put them together. Jeez, that's real complicated. That's basically all there is to it, but apparently, yes, move my camera a little bit. Whoops. Oop. My horrible nails are getting in the way. I just push that down a bit. not very balanced. But you get the idea. There you go. <laughs> you get the idea. So that's what that one is. Um, there's these little girls on the back playing with them and spitting them around. And apparently there's a free magic kinder app. Go figure. So there you go guys, that was my quick mystery unboxing video. Leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Click the button down there if you want to subscribe. And leave me a comment down below. I try to respond to all comments and I will see you in my next video. See ya.